Uh, let's 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 cover Ninja. This has been this has been a big topic on the Twitch. Okay, and we're a part of the Twitch now. Now you're going to walk me through this. We're a part I'm, of the ecosystem because I'm not I'm not cool with knowledge of what's what on, yep. out, out there in the in the internet world. Yeah. Okay. I like filling you in. I Good. like letting Good. you know so what's happening in internet. Is gossip. Ninja an actual Ninja? Uh, he could be. Right. I mean, uh, I, I don't know him. Okay. Yeah, let's let's always be upfront with that. Generally, okay. I don't know anyone, so okay. I don't know him either. Right. Um, but he could have some some ninjutsu skills. I mean, it's okay. It's possible, and and that inspired his. It hasn't been disproven his, that he's not a ninja. Like, right. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So potentially, Moz, but yeah. I mean, it's it's mostly just a cool name. Right. It's right. Simple. It's like a, it's a nom de plume. It's a yeah, yeah, it's an alias. Yeah, it's he's a, a ninja at games. Is he like Fortnite? He's fucking, he fucking smashes it. Right, right. So, so it's ninja in the general sense of very good at something. Yes, not I'd say so. Yeah. yeah, that's yeah. Okay. Not necessarily a medieval Japanese assassin. No, so much as shit hot at video gaming. No, but he's agile and he's nimble and okay. he's, he's fucking good at the game. He's got good thumb dexterity. Yes, good dexterity with the fingers yeah, for the good. gaming. So good. that's probably how the brand name works. It's good. I'm glad we talked that out. Yep. We bloody, I reckon we've analysed that correctly. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, look, in the, in the last week, Ninja said, oh, I'm not going to stream with, with women, uh, women gamers. I'm, I don't want a bar of it. I, I'm not getting involved with any female gamers because he doesn't want media writing fake news or anything about like him flirting with, with uh, women streamers. So he's just nipping it in the butt. He's trying to get ahead of the headlines. So okay. he's like, if I just don't stream with female gamers, no one can accuse me of flirting with them or vice versa, and then my wife won't get pissed. Have people Because he's got a wife. Right. So he's like, I'm, I'm going to respect the relationship and the boundaries of the marriage. And not play video games with women. And not play video Is games with women. Is playing video games with women generally considered cheating in this day and age? Because I think I've played video games with women, mm. and I've never, like, fessed up to the wife about it and said, honey, I'm sorry, uh, last night. You know, my sister and I... No, probably not my sister. It's not an example. Mm. But is that actually a thing? I've played board games with women. Yeah. And it's been fun. I've played Dungeons and Dragons with women. Yeah. Yeah. We played Cards Against Humanity. We did. And that's filthy. It's filthy as there hell. There were women and men it's at full, that party. It's all about making dirty jokes. Yeah. Yeah. And we all played together and that yeah. was filthy as fuck. Yeah. But it was fine. I don't think anyone got uh, jealous or there was no gossip headlines either. Yeah. No one wrote, like, in the West Australian, Aussie Man and Mozza play Cards Against Humanity. In, in, a, you know, in a mixed gender environment. Yeah. We didn't get any headlines about that. Oh, so okay. Was so he's, but he's admittedly all right. He's a, he's a lot bigger than than us. So yeah, maybe fair people enough. out well, there. Well, he's a ninja. He's a ninja. So yeah. maybe people out there will write will write a headline about it in, in the gossip world and, and other is videos there? on YouTube and stuff and just dickheads talking about it like us. Right. I guess he wants to get ahead of people talking about it, but then it makes people talk about it more because it's, it's a pretty extreme solution. And to make a public statement about it, that's yep. weird. Yeah. See, if you were genuinely... Because maybe... Okay, so maybe he's paranoid about the whole Me Too movement, right? Mm. And he's thinking, well, if I don't have women involved with my, with my channel, then there's no kind of... You know, nothing can come back on me later if anyone accuses me of anything or says anything. Yeah. But why wouldn't you just kind of adopt that as a policy rather than making this big kind of statement about it? It's, it's weird, isn't it? Yeah, it came up in an interview with Polygon. So he's already oh, doing okay. an interview with a, with a media outlet. And they said, why are there no, why are there no chicks bloody co-stream with you? Is Maybe. I don't know what the exact question would have been, but it came up in that, in that interview. We haven't had a woman on this show so far. I've noticed. No, we've got, we've we interact with them in the chat room. We though, do. I'm pretty sure. Is anyone? I mean, it's hard to avoid them. This is why it's such a. Yeah. This is why people are talking about it. Is because it, it feels quite extreme. Well, I mean, how do you just avoid women? How do you Even avoid if, half the world's population? Right. Yeah. And in the professional environment, like I mean, yeah. professional gamer, everyone's wanting this to be a legitimate term and a legitimate job that's recognised as a job. So you think it's professional to. Stream yeah. with kind of anyone. It's funny because the whole you... the whole video gaming culture has had some problems. You know the whole game of game thing and whatever else. It's had a, it's had a few accusations of misogyny and you yeah. know all this kind of stuff. Surely men and women hanging out together playing games in a public broadcast kind of forum is a good thing, right? Mm. Surely, like you know, a couple of people enjoying Fortnite or whatever the hell they're playing. Yeah, that's that's a good thing to see, right? Oh, it's just you know. There's no big deal. But for him to say it could be read as flirtation. Yeah. What, because you're sitting on the same sofa? 
Yeah. You know, I don't. It's weird. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's it's. You're right. It doesn't it doesn't help with with kind of the gaming industry trying no. to not look misogynist or anything like no. that. And it's a bit of a shame. It's probably a shame for him that he's made that decision. Maybe there's an interaction we're not seeing, and his wife has gotten pissed off at him about something. You see, now you just end up having people talk about your relationship more. Exactly. Because they're trust issues. Yeah. Because because how do you just avoid women? Even even my Gmail inbox. It's like half the marketing managers that fucking ask if you want to do sponsored gigs, they're, they're fucking women. Yeah. You can't avoid them. Oh, marketing is run know. by women. Oh, yeah. Women are like the Illuminati of marketing. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know. Like, you can avoid them in terms of colleagues who are streamers as well. And I yeah. guess he's got to be selective with, with who he chooses to stream with because he's, he's big. So, you know, if you're going to give people lots of attention, you've got to like him. Okay, but, so uh, here's my question about his relationship because I'm going there because he's inviting this. I'm okay. going there. I'm, I'm putting my nose in his private shit. All right. All right. His yep. private shit. His shit, my nose is going in there. Fucking take a whiff. Yep, just going to... I'm going to breathe deep. Breathe right. some ninja private life. Ninja poop right up in the nostril. Right up there. Not scared. What's What are you thinking? I'm thinking either his wife is an incredibly jealous, suspicious person or he has zero trust of himself. There's something going on. Oh. There's something going on. Yeah, that's an interesting one. Or maybe a bit of both. You make that rule to kind of restrain yourself, to Ma- not give yourself any temptation. Mm-hmm. Because, I mean, he's a celebrity, I suppose, you know. He's got a lot of attention, a lot of people looking up to him. He's going to lots of events where he wears a suit. Mm-hmm. And there's like a red carpet and stuff, I think. Yep. And well, you had a suit jacket on before. You were sexy as fuck. Yeah. The sexual... T- I mean, you probably didn't feel it. I don't know if it was like a required sexual tension. Yeah. But I saw you in that jacket. I went, holy shit. There's a man who could take care of me. I felt different. I yeah. felt like a celebrity or something, like yeah. at the Academy Awards or some shit. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, he puts the jacket on, he goes out, and he's like a proper celebrity. So, yeah, maybe he's trying to, to not give himself any temptations. Wow. As well. Which is kind of, I don't know. It's a very strict rule. It's just a very strict rule overall. The whole thing's so bloody strange. That's why people are talking about it, I suppose. Yeah. Do you think people would ever accuse us of flirting? Is there, uh, is there I think any, they already have. Is there any chance that you're going to like ban me from the show on the off chance that your wife gets jealous? Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. I don't stream with Mozza anymore. Yeah. Just Milton. Yeah, because I like this gig. Yeah. Yeah, I quite like it. So I just think we should agree up front not to make any big statements about we're not going to stream together anymore. We'll just say we won't flirt. Mm. And if anything is seen as flirting, well, that's in the eyes of the viewer. Right. Yeah. And, and, and there's nothing we can do about that. No. Like if people want to make those speculations. Sure. I mean. I mean, how far ahead is he going to get mm. in terms of trying to stop people making speculations about his life? Yeah. Because you're already putting it out there in public. I mean, he works hard. He's fucking streaming 10, 12 hours a day. More. I don't know. He's, wow. I know. It's fucking intense. He, he's a Oh, hard, okay. Well, that changes things. 12 company. hours a day. Oh, yeah. Well, then if he was to like stream with a female, he'd basically be living with her. So maybe there's something there. Oh, that's interesting, too. You end mm. up spending more time with her than mm. you're spending with your wife. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. Yeah, interesting. Okay. 12 hours a day. Oh, man, yeah. He's fucking... He's, he's full on. And are people watching this 12 it. hours at a time? I'd say so. I mean, yeah, wow. the audience fluctuates and comes and goes. But, yeah, I mean, people stick around and watch for a while. I mean, yeah, even right. our little show, yeah. two hours can go like that. That is true. Before you fucking that is know true. it. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. So, yeah, no, he's, he's, he bloody puts the hours But in. he's like the bloody weather channel. He's just on. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, like a 24-hour news site or something shit crashes on the couch yep. takes the dog for a walk wow just back to it back to the fortnight bloody hell yeah okay yeah so no it's a hashtag full on life it's wow bloody yeah yeah where was I going were we working towards a point oh I don't know if we were but no. I, I, I still think the whole thing is a bit wacky yeah it's a little bit I don't know it's I just, iffy it's iffy I it's don't, iffy I don't know what's happened I don't know if his, his, his relationship's are rocky and the wife said you know yeah I saw the way you smiled at Camille last week I don't know if there's a Camille I just made that up there might be a Camille Who female knows? streamer maybe had Camille on twice yeah right she's like I see you had that Camille on twice you oh she's like back her. again is she, is she back working, on is she you're working with her again oh mm. you thought you'd give her a call you got her number have you she's mm. in your phone is she yeah. yeah, I don't there's know. Some dickheads down in Australia who are talking about it. That's right. Now there's gossip. Yep. Now there's clickbait gossip. If Mrs. Ninja's in the chat room, I would like to, you know, make yourself known. Because, mm. um, you know, I just, oh, I wonder what's going on. Yeah, we got questions. Yeah. It's worth interviewing her rather than him. Exactly. From this point. Yeah, well, how, what's her reaction? Really get to the bottom of it. Yeah. Mm. Bloody hell. 
Uh, I just it, it's weird. Anyway, yeah. anyway, we'll be fine. And look, if the audience wants to speculate about any kind of mm. uh, emotional state that we're in yep. on our particular show at any time, yep. in regards to the content we put out, yep. then I mean, you're welcome to do it. Sure. It comes with the lifestyle. It does you know? At the end of the day, yep. it fucking harden the fuck up. Yeah, I would say so. Comes with the lifestyle. Yeah. Just and if you some... are in a relationship with another human being, accept the fact they may occasionally talk to other people. Um, they do that. That might happen. Yeah. Yeah. You still got to have interactions with other human beings. You do. Uh, professionally. Yeah. Or definitely. socially. Socially too. You yeah. know, you might walk out in your front lawn, there might be someone standing there. Yeah. They might be, you know, picking up their dog poop. You got to say hello. Yeah. You can't just spend your life like not making eye contact. Does Ninja say hello to other women walking their dogs? I wonder. Does How far will he go with this? I well, mean, it starts in the workplace. If you stream in 12 hours a day, he may not be leaving the house. Yeah. He might be more extreme than you. Yeah. You know, you're at least leaving the house to have a baby. Yep. Yeah. I'll get out for Which like is a big, days. good start for you. I'm proud of you. Thanks. T- taking a step. Yep. Yeah. Um, yeah. How far will he go? Mm. You start with this and then it just keeps going out. Just no more women interactions ever. Wow. And what do they do? Like, if someone says hi to him. Mm. <clears throat> like if he's at, at an event and how far will it go like if he if someone thinks he's flirting with a guy on the show what then does he ban men wow you know and and, and on that will leave him what he could have like intersex people or non-binary people or, or and, and then like if someone thinks oh I, the media goes oh he might be flirting with that person mm. um, with X the person of no fixed gender and then he's left with Milton he, he, yeah that's true you can bl- bloody go through my email inbox if yeah. you want to reach out ninja and stream with Milton I can hook that up Milton's pretty safe Milton's pretty safe. I mean, he flirts, but he—you you know, it's all just play. It's all in fun. Yeah. There's no, there's no, li- there's no lingering eye contact that says, you know. No, it's just a bit of banter. I'm playing, or am I? See, Milton doesn't add the or am I at the end. Right. It's just straight up. You he know doesn't have fun. agendas. No. We know him. He's not no. got any fucking hidden agendas. No. no.